Hey, this is Lynn Griffin again, your Director of Club Fitting Operations with the PPGS. And today I've decided I'm going to take a moment and I'm going to try and convince you to stop thinking about golf shafts in relationship to a flex. I still get a lot of questions on the blog regarding flex. What flex should I play? Da 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 da. So, uh, let me again explain exactly what flex is. Uh, it, uh, uh, well, I can't explain what flex is because there is no standard for flex any longer. Uh, in days gone by, flex used to mean that at a given length you could count on this shaft, that shaft, or the other shaft. If it said regular, you know that it vibrated within the given parameters. That is no longer the case. Uh, each individual company now sets what they want to consider to be their guidelines for what they put on the shaft, whether it's a regular flex, stiff flex, extra stiff, lady, what have you. Uh, also, as you see here, I have my uh, Malt B frequency analyzer. Uh, that is how we check CPMs or cycles per minute, which is the actual vibration of the shaft. Now, I'm using a 5-inch clamp. Uh, if you had somebody that was using a two and a half inch clamp and let's say we took the same shaft and measured it I'm going to get a higher rate of cycles than a person using a two and a half inch clamp so now there's another variable thrown into it so what your professional club builder is going to do is profile the shaft because right now if I wanted to just talk about butt flex I'd stick it in here clamp it down put a weight on it, twang it, and read out what it said. That is just that much of the shaft. So when we profile a shaft, we're going to take the shaft and its entire length, we're going to mark it at 41 inches, 36, 31, 26, 21, 16, and 11. And I have a ruler here to do that. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to take two shafts as you happen to notice, yes, this is the UST pink shaft that I have told people that I play and uh, kind of gotten some kidding and some question as to whether I'm really serious that I play that shaft. But just the answer, yes, I do. With my pink grip, here's my 43 and a half inch 355 cc KZG driver. Um, so yes, guys, I do play what I say I play. So. I'm going to take two shafts. I'm going to take the, the uh, Proforce Lady Shaft, and I'm going to take the new AVIX Core uh, Blue 59 gram A flat shaft, and I'm going to profile these two shafts, and then we're going to talk about what I found out. So the first thing I'm going to do, take a wax pencil. I'm laying it down on my ruler, and I'm going to mark it off again at those uh, uh, measurements that I said. And I'm going to do that, and then we'll go from there. Okay, now I've got the shafts marked. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take them and put them in the frequency analyzer. I'll lamp it down. So the first measurement that I'm going to read is at 41 inches. Now I'm going to take a one-pound weight and put it on the tip end of the driver, turn the analyzer on, let it set, reset it, and then I'm going to twang it, let it come up, and I'm going to mark down all the readings that I told you about, and then we're going to record them, and we're going to compare the two shafts. Okay, now that I've gotten both shafts, what we call profile, I took the numbers, ran them through both shafts and those different lengths and what we came up with um, we're going to take the two numbers 41 and 36 inches we're going to average those then we're going to take the three numbers at 31 26 and 21 inches average those and then we're going to take two numbers at 16 and 11 and average those so we're going to come up with a number for the butt middle and tip an average frequency. On the pink shaft, remember this is a lady shaft. 
the average frequency was 171 for the senior flex shaft 175 middle section for the pink shaft ladies 263 for the senior 262 for the tip section lady shaft 616 senior shaft 561 and a half so now what in the world have we found out just like I said uh, the other day on the block this ladies shaft will actually play stiffer than this senior shaft it has a much stiffer tip section the overall weight of the shaft is higher the middle section is just a tiny bit stiffer the only place that this senior shaft is stiffer is by four cycles and it's under the grip so when I go and fit people I'm actually looking from this end back because this end is where the club head is and that's what's hitting the golf ball so that's been it on profiling and I hope you can see now that you can't just go by what's painted on the shaft as part of a flex profiling the shaft gives you a complete picture of what that shaft does so this has been Lynn Griffin with the PPGS again if you have questions please feel free to email them or send them in on the blog and we appreciate your support and remember better golf is just a fit away